So when you start the clips, this is what the screen will look like. And in its default mode, it's actually set up for software developers to do Java programming. Um, so one of the first things you, you're going to want to do is set up this screen layout so that it's suitable for the modeling tool which we're going to use. Um, and that modeling tool is called Papyrus. Um, there's a variety of ways of setting screen layout in Eclipse, but the most obvious is if you go to the window option and then click on Perspective and then Open Perspective and then Other. Um, and perspective basically is a collection of uh, you know, sub-windows and windows in, in the tool. So that once you select the correct one here, it lays out the whole screen as you want it. And what we're interested here is in Papyrus. So I'm just going to click on Papyrus and OK. And it will take a few seconds, but it will lay it out as um, you know as preferred by the, um, you know, the Papyrus UML SysML tool. Um, once you've done this, you'll notice there are two buttons up here. Um, so that if you ever do get the, you know, you want to swap backs and forwards, you, it's easy enough just now to, to click backs and forwards between the layout. It's actually very flexible in terms of layout, this tool, and, you know, as you might expect, all of these uh, different panes can drag and drop, you can move them around, you can change their widths, you know, so you can change their layout here. Um, some of the panes, you notice, have multiple tabs, and so you can click on the tabs and, and bring those to the front and backs and forwards. Um, you can, although I'm not sure I'd recommend it, but you can just pick up these tabs and, um, and actually move them around. So you can actually move them into, as you see them jumping around to different parts of the screen. Yeah, so you can really be have a very flexible layout in the way that you, you set up these screens. I can, let's pick up that outline there and put it in the bottom of that there. So you, you can really lay out this screen however you think is um, most suitable for the drawing you've done. Um, if at any point you get so confused with this screen that it's laid out incorrectly, you can always go back, back to Window and Perspective and Reset Perspective. And what that will do is take it back to the default for Papyrus or you know, if you're in Java, it'll take it back to the default in, in Java. So if you do get confused with the layout at any point, you can always do that. Um, it's going to be less interest to you using SysML UML because this screen is set up correctly. But but just so that you know, you can also show um, rather specific views here associated with programming, um, you know, model explorers and validation and outlines and so on. These are all set up for um, uh, you know, programming in Java typically, and there are a long list of these if you if you hit other. Um, anyway, we're not going to be really using any of those. Once you've got the Java perspective set up, um, that's absolutely fine.